Advanced Segments and Profiles This tutorial aims at comparing the pros and cons of using advanced segments versus profiles and filters in order to observe a part of your data. Let's say, for example, you want to observe only your paid traffic. You can either select the paid traffic advanced segment on the top right corner, or you can create a profile with the help of a filter. Using advanced segments offers lots of advantages. First, it can be applied to historical data. On the opposite, creating a profile only applies as of the date of the creation of the filter. Secondly, advanced segments are available across all profiles and accounts. Web profiles are only used for specific web property. The third advantage of using advanced segments is that you can compare up to four advanced segments at a time. On the opposite, using profiles, you can only view one at a time. The last advantage is that advanced segments are super easy to create. So, using advanced segments are really attractive. However, creating a few profiles are useful in certain situations. For example, when you need to permanently affect a part of your data. It can also be useful when your subset of data is sufficiently important that it can be analyzed by itself, for example, for paid traffic. Creating a profile can also be useful when you need to restrict the user access to only a part of your data. I hope this tutorial helps you choose between advanced segments or filters for your own Google Analytics accounts. For more, subscribe to Semitis YouTube channel.